Hello YouTube, we're going to cook something on our little camp stove today. It means we put so much work into it. We had it in the big shop, it got kind of rusted. Repainted, burned the paint off, made the stove pipe. You've already seen them videos. Our little five dollar folding saw. We found that at a fleet and farm store. Here's our original Bowie knife. <laughs> I like how they did that. This was made in the 70s. My older brother had one. But I don't remember it saying that on it, but it was the same exact handle, the same look. And if you turn this, I take a picture of that. Edge brand, made in Germany. Sol Solingen? I never can pronounce that. But. Yeah, we use that on our. This is like wooden lath. Like you use in construction, or people used to put plastic on the windows of their houses in the old days. They're just a wide lath, about an inch or so wide. Um, I don't have another piece laying around here, do I? Just this stuff. Find a home supply store. So I had a bunch of it, and it's all dried out and cracked. So there you go. We'll get this thing fired up. There's a lot of wood in there. That's big. The big stuff, walnut. It's kind of doughy, but it'll work. We're gonna cook something simple. Stay tuned. Okay, let's fire it up. We're gonna cheat. We hate using paper. Paper makes a mess. Never stick more on your tip into the fire. You don't know where these things leak at. This thing leaks down there by the knob. I can point my finger to it when I'm done. Don't ask me how I found it out. I'm sticking too far in the barbecue. This thing leaks right here. I found it out. Okay. Let's see how this does. Okay, now we don't want a big hot fire, so we're going to get this shut down so it burns slow. We don't want the stove like when we're burning the paint off, so we're going to be shutting everything down here. We'll be shutting the door, and we'll be shutting this down a ways. That's all the way shut. Now, I made these different. I made my other stove so they'd shut down further in there because the ashes would fall out the door to hold, but this thing, it doesn't matter. There we go. We'll figure out what we're going to cook here in a second. Stay tuned. Okay, we're going to make a good old grilled cheese. We were going to put some sliced ham on it. Now we're going to keep this simple. because this, We're all still experimenting. This little square sandwich skilled is a lodge. I'm sure it came from Walmart. It's cheapy. I do not like the uh, coating on it, but it works. I've used it before. But I really don't prefer the coating seasoning on it. Well, there's the first side. It's doing pretty good. But this man works good. Like I said, I just don't like their coating. But it's not bad for using outdoors. I wouldn't want to use something like this in the house. Because it'll start smoking on the bottom, believe me. That stuff on the bottom will start smoking on an electric burner or a gas burner. My little spatula. I should be saying hello to my little spatula. I found this at a thrift store. I don't know what it's for. Serving pie cake. What do you think it was made for? It was made for this, of course. For camping. See the hole in it? And there's the second side. We don't want to burn it. We don't mind it they get a little black. I would eat it when I was a kid, but we're kind of picky. What's the cheese look like? Ooh, melted, gooey, good. Look at that. That's just cheap sliced cheese wrapped in the cellophane. Mmm, making y'all hungry. That ain't nice. You need, you need to get a stove, get a barbecue, get outside. It's summertime. Do some cooking. Thanks for watching.